Simon just gave me the uh, the best quote ever. He said, "Being an adult is hard." <laughs> I've heard myself say that a lot lately. Yeah, well, how old are you? 26. Yeah, 27 is really like the enter into adulthood. Yeah, like right now, like since. 30 is not as bad as 27 is. Because 27, I got a card one time for 27 that said, uh, it was like all the things that, that happens at 27. And number one was, nobody cares what you did in high school anymore. Yeah. You could have been the greatest high school football player at 27. Yeah. You can't talk about it anymore. Right. Well, uh, good, luckily for me, you guys are such a-holes that you cut that out of my life real quick. You're whatever you did in high school? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah you didn't care. So I was just like, I don't tell anyone that ever. But yeah. like my grandparents, they still do. So like, I didn't tell Blaine like, I broke a school record or anything like that. Mm -hmm. But the first time my, Blaine met my grandparents. Most meetings under the bleachers? No. Mm -hmm. uh, but the first time my grandparents met Blaine, they, like, brought it all out. Did you know Sandra was the <laughs> long jump holder yeah. of Michigan suburbs? No, I scored the most points in a single game, 34. Woo -woo. And did he oh. just go, oh. Well, cool. <laughs> well, I mean, no, because it's my grandparents. So, you know, like, he's respectful. And he was like, I didn't You're know that. I didn't know she was so good. I knew she Michael played in Horton. college. Uh, but <laughs> Michael Horton. Yeah. Your name. But yeah. So anyway, so I'm very proud of your accomplishments no, you're not. for the next couple of months. Shut up. Then you are out. <laughs> what? what? How about thirty? Is thirty going to be disappointing for you or depressing? Um, it's not so bad. It depends where I'm at. Will you're you right be, here? Will you be oh. married by thirty? No. Yes. Yeah, you will. I don't. Yes, you will. I, will you be pregnant before or or with uh, child by thirty? No, I don't want kids and I don't want to get married. I don't know why that's such a thing. <laughs> no, no, no matter. <laughs> Galvin didn't want to buy a house. Galvin yeah. didn't want to get married. Galvin didn't want to have, have to kids. Do yep. Listen, right now is the wrong time to ask me about this stuff because. Do you think you might be pregnant? God no! Like I said, I punch myself in the stomach every morning no. and every night. Good for you. To girl. double check. That's fine. But no, like. Kenny wakes me up at 3 o'clock every morning because uh -huh. he wants breakfast, but he has to wait an hour. <clears throat> he has to wait till 4. That's his breakfast time. So I always, 3 o'clock, get up, get a couple carrots, put him in his cage, go back to bed for an hour. That, you know what I mean? I'd be like, shut up, pig. Yeah, uh, right? Well, he, he just roots you. He won't stop. Yeah. Like, he'll push me off the bed. So I do this, <clears throat> and normally I go back to bed, fine. Today, couldn't do it. And I just laid there stewing about everything oh, I hate no. about Blaine. Oh, oh. oh, what did she do? Oh, what did he dude. do, rather? Listen, it's the little things. You come home, oh, you say hi. Yeah. Oh, you I should say hi. That. Right. You go to bed, you say goodnight. Oh, no. <laughs> Are you crying already? Why are you oh, crying? No. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, no. my God. Said, nope. I didn't even uh -huh. do anything. <laughs> nope. I'm on Blaine's side. <laughs> no. I am on Blaine's I'm not. side. You got to say goodnight. You got to say hello and goodnight. Team Carmen. Right. So I was just like, oh, you know what? I'm not going to say bye when I leave for work. Uh, did you? No, I didn't. Oh, Good. man. You oh. taught him a lesson. Yeah. Didn't yeah. wake what? him up. He didn't oh. care. <laughs> he didn't care. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, he doesn't care. I'm on your side. Wow. I won't touch your face either. <laughs> right, while I'm thank doing you. It. I'm going to call you every night and say goodnight. <laughs> Mike is hugging Carmen just have, so she doesn't kill him when she goes on her rampage. No. Never been more mad at a hug before than <laughs> right now. <laughs> I got up. I walked over there. Damn Thank it. you. Carmen, you should say goodnight to you. I'm going to text you every night. Right. Night I mean, just the little things. What a jerk, Blaine. <laughs> have you discussed this with him yet? Yes, of course. What does he say? He, just, he, he, does, he, it says, two, he does it for two nights, and then it just ends. And then, you know, then you bring it back up, and then you're nagging. And then it's just, well, why are you going to say it? Oh, ugh, I'm going to bed. Oh. Man. You know what I mean? It's just the little things like that. No, I agree with you. I mean, oh, I now you agree. Yeah. I have agreed with her <laughs> you for a while. Right. <laughs> I'm on Blaine's side. No, <laughs> that's the of wrong side to be are. on, Galvin. You're a bad person. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Damn, get your act together, Blaine. Well, you know, so it's just like, no, I don't want to get married. Because if this is the way it is, if this is how it is when you get married, that the love just goes away and then you just are two people who live with each other. That's right. Screw that. I don't want to get married. I'd Next thing you know, you'd be sleeping in the guest room. I'd rather just get a new boyfriend every two years. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. A and better boyfriend. Yeah. yeah upgrade. A richer, then, fatter, you know, baller boyfriend. That's fine. I mean, you, if you're going to be, if you're going to take me on trips, then no, you don't have to say goodnight. But if I have to clean the kitchen <laughs> yeah. and take care of the yeah. animals, well, say goodnight then you to can me. say goodnight. At least a little kiss on the forehead. <laughs> this is the same argument Noah's wife had when they were living on the ark. Yeah. If I have to feed the pigs, yeah. Yeah. you better say goodnight to me. Right. If I have to feed the pig that I got. <laughs> I mean, no, not. Listen, I'm the one who gives uh, them a bath. Yeah. Uh, I give them both a bath. I feed them at night. 
I take care of him. I pick up the poop at least. He can't even pick up Doke's poop, which Kenny eats. Yeah. And I have to tell him in the morning, hey, pick up Doke's poop. <laughs> One time he has to pick it up. One time during the day. The rest did of the time, think, I pick it up two to three times a day. Did you cool think when you were scoring 34 points in one game that you'd be picking up pig poop and dog poop? No, I and didn't. Complaining there and complaining and crying. Be time. I, yeah. thought, I can't even handle it. I thought I'd be in Brazil, like, loving basketball, playing. Right, you'd be, like, in the, the European oh. female league. Yeah, circuit. Just Girls traveling. going down on you in the yeah. shower. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then I realized I wasn't a lesbian, and oh, here no. I am. Oh, got wow. a boyfriend with Tourette's. So I'm just saying, so, th- so th- this morning I woke up at 3, couldn't go back to bed, and that's what I laid in bed until my alarm went off, stewing about, just thinking, like, what is this? Yeah, what is this? Is it worth it? What is well, life? I know. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. For a second I took you serious. <laughs> For a second I did. You know. Wow. So being an adult is hard. Yes, I agree with you. Relationships are hard, too. Ugh. If I've learned my lesson is to agree with everything that Carmen says. <laughs> Especially during this segment because I am the keeper of Sporkle. Mm-hmm. That is damn right. <laughs> damn right. All right, let's get to it. A little Sporkle. Here we go. <laughs> Galvin, what line will you be playing for? Streaks, I will win today for line 14. My wife and I got in a fight last night because we didn't like chairs. What? I want to buy this chair. You'll love this chair. Yeah. And she was like, oh, like that. I was like, oh, <laughs> shut up. Yeah. Hi, who is this? Yes. Yes. Who are you? Yes. Scott. Scott, please hold. Galvin's playing for you. Spanish. Line three, please. Good morning. Who is this? This is Brian. Hi, Brian. Spanish is playing for you. I'll take line 16. Hello. Who is this? Bob. Hello, Bob. I'm playing for you, sir. I think Carmen made Papap scared to come in. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Unless she finally croaked. Oh, I hope not. I was going to say, and at least you buy your chair. Like, yeah, she doesn't like it, but you're buying that chair. Mm. You'd look at a chair and be like, hey, want to split it? Oh, Oh. man. That is messed up. You do not split chairs. Uh, You never split a chair. Yeah. God. Will you look at this chair real quick and see if you like it? (laughs) Just really quick. I just want to know if one day we're going to live together. This one? Oh, yeah. That looks super Right? Yeah. Or this one? Oh, it just looks, that just looks uh, nice. It just looks like nice. Perfect lounge how about, chairs. How about this one? Woo, what's up? You want to get him a rocket? <laughs> okay, thank you very much. <laughs> That's a mega and, black chair. And right I would say goodnight to you. How do you like that? Nice. Sweet Carmen is the keeper of Sparkle. And Joseph Iron Maiden DeSanto is your backup judge. Won't let it go. Huh? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Not letting it go. Nope. Uh, I had a great time without you. I feel like I should rub it in your face. Mike woke up at 3 o'clock in this, this morning and was sitting there stewing about you going to see the Iron mm-hmm. Man. Is that, <laughs> is that true? Over us. Over I'm, us. So, I'm going to make it up. I'm going to make it up this weekend. No, I'm not. I don't no, care. I whatever. can't make it up. <laughs> you can go, but I won't pay attention to you. Can I do the song two times? Can I do the song <laughs> two times? All right. Maybe we're on some. Uh, Carmen, what are we playing today? Okay. So this is kind of a fun one. We've never done this one before. Can you name the TV shows that might have spurred these lawsuits? Okay. And All then, right. if you can't get it, I do have an actor, actor, actor or actress that starred in the TV show. Okay. But the first, I'm going to give you the lawsuit. All right. So it's going to be someone versus someone. Okay. First one, uh, Pendleton State University versus High Commander uh, Solomon. Friday Night Lights. No. That is going to be John Lithgow. With Third Ride from the Sun. Galvin. 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 <laughs> I gotta get it out. Okay. Yeah. All right. Richards, Grant, and Slaughter versus WJM. Valerie Harper. One day at a time. Rhoda. Oh, General that's... Hospital. No. Mary Tyler Moore. Yeah. Yeah, I said the wrong person. <laughs> Crawley Earl of Grantham. Uh, uh, Down Abbey. Earl. Downton Abbey, Mike. Stratford Inn versus... Uh, Newhart. Yes, Mike. United States Department of Justice versus Scully. X-Files. X-Files, Mike. American Society of Composers, Authors, and Publishers versus Ricky Ricardo. I love Lucy. Galvin. Thanks. Oh. oh, come on. That was, you even you knew. Oh. I see your face. <laughs> um, Drug Enforcement Administration. Breaking Bad. 
Yes. You know your drugs. I do. <laughs> Tripper versus... Three, three's three. company. Yes, Mike. Estate of Lane Price versus Sterling Cooper. Uh, Mad Men. Yes, Mike Kelta. Spanish. We're halfway there. Uh, Lane uh, Price hung himself. The score right now. In the office. <laughs> Galvin and I are tied in last with one. Michael's straight crushing it right now with a total of six. Yeah, I like that. I like the way that goes. All right. Uh, Kimball versus Indiana Department of Correction. Fugitive. Yes. Michael Scott Paper Company. Office. Mike. Uh, Prickard versus Borg Cybernetic Organism Hive. Star Trek. Yes. Picard. I don't know. <laughs> Didn't I say Picard? No, you said Pritchard. Oh. Uh, you said Pickard. Yeah. Oh. Pickard. I don't know. Um, Pewter Schmidt versus uh, Pawtucket Brewing Company. Uh, King of the Hill. Seth MacFarlane. Family Guy. Yeah, the other one. Yeah. Uh, Not the other one. <laughs> huh? Not the other one. The other cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Costanza versus... Seinfeld. Yes. <clears throat> Commissioner of the Office of Land Management. Parks and Rec. Versus uh, Ewing Oil. Dallas. Yes, Mike Kelta. Estate of Lannister. Game of Thrones. Yes, Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> We're on the excited. last three. <laughs> 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 Calvin is in last with two. Now I'm in second with four. And uh, Mike Mike is destroying it. He's got nine. You got nine right now. Remember this? Remember this? I've been holding remember on this, this one for a while. Eight in a row, Eight. nine in a row. I will bet you $1,000 you don't make it to a nine in a row. Okay. If you win, you on give this, me $1,000. On this streak right now, you will not make it to nine in a row. If you I do, you give me $1,000. If you don't, you give me $1,000. No, I don't. Uh, <laughs> I'm so not confident. Go ahead, finish it up. All right. Just not overconfident. Yep, Just well, take it better. up, buddy. Yep. Last three. Malone versus Fenway Cheers. Sports Cheers. Group. Galvin. Rubble versus Bojack. Whatever. Say spit. Yeah, I get it. Spanish. <laughs> Dr. Sam. Great <Brain> anchors. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Dr. Samuel Beckett um, versus on. United States Department of the Navy. Uh, Nash. Samuel <laughs> oh. Beckett. Scott. <laughs> Bacula. Oh, oh, Bacula. 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 Quantum <laughs> leap. Come on. I don't know. I like it. You said it like Dracula. Bacula. Bacula. <laughs> Bacula. Bacula. Final, final, final score. Final score. Bacula. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, the final score, Michael. Uh, Galvin was the last with three. I was the second with five, and you crushed it. You had nine. It's a new me. Yeah. It's on you right now. That is four wins in a row. Very nice. And the wins for the year, I am, of course, in last with only three wins. Michael, you are in second with 12 wins. And Galvin is leading by eight wins with a total of 20. By the time I break the streak and get 10 in a row, I'll be back. Yeah. So never? (laughs) You know, if you're so confident, give me the $1,000. I just did. I bet you $1,000. No, give me the $1,000. No. What do we have coming up in news, Confidence? Uh, Coming up in news, you can't eat the beads. Oh, you can. Let it burn. And Steven Seagal is writing books. <laughs> oh, my God. Do what? you know the other thing about Steven Seagal? What are uh, I don't know. what it is. I won't say anything, but what is, just tell me what his book is about. Trump. Oh, no, no, no. There's something else about Steven Seagal. Okay. I'll tell you when you bring all that right. up. All right. And it all ties in. I, I did not, for some reason, I don't know why, but I watched Tom Segura's second special and his third special, the most recent one. And then I was like, well, there's a first one I never watched. So I went back and watched it yesterday. Because I love Tom Segura now. Yeah, you do. And he does a whole thing about Steven Seagal, which is hilarious. How Steven Seagal is an expert on everything. And the, he goes, you walk by a dog, and he goes, that's a that's a basset porgy. So how do you know I know dogs? <laughs> <laughs> Seagal knows everything. Now he knows about Trump. And wait till I tell you. Wait till I tell you what he knows about now. I'm very excited. You're going to be excited. All right, News with Galvin coming up next. It's a Mike Calder show. Mike Calder Show on 1025 The Bone.